My name is David Brewer. I'm fifth generation family to manage this operation. Uh, it was founded in 1883. We raise mostly wheat, cattle, barley, canola, mustard are the crops that we predominantly raise. A variety of forage crops for the cattle. We finish all of our cattle here on the ranch so we don't ship them off to feedlots anyplace. So we uh, currently we're grass finishing everything and direct marketing them or selling them to grocery stores in Portland. I think to me there's more incentive almost to do the direct seed in the low rainfall environment because you just don't have the water to give away and certainly in this case we don't have the soil to give away. I, but I think in terms of low rainfall there's just as much to gain from a productivity standpoint by keeping that soil undisturbed and the residue on top of the soil. Um, and like everything else, attitude is everything. If you think it'll work, you'll figure out how to make it work. If you don't think it'll work, it probably won't work for you. <laughs> so We don't have to get it to maturity, right? We don't have to ask it to produce seed for us. We just have to ask it to grow and feed the soil, you know, put some roots down. So that just opens up some options. We've known for a long time that if we can raise a forage crop, you know, you don't have to run it through the combine. You can, you can bring cows to it and cows will come a long ways to find good feed, right? <laughs> I certainly don't want to be the guy that <laughs> doesn't give the sixth generation the opportunity, so um, that's important. But uh, I think that, um, you know, we're, we're trying to look at it from a long-term perspective and rather than just what's going to generate the most revenue next year, you know, we're trying to just make sure that we're constantly improving the resource here and making sure that there's a better opportunity for the, for the next generation. And uh, I think as long as we keep focused on doing the right thing for the soil, uh, for the land, then it'll all come, come out in the end. So. <laughs>